Hey my beauties, welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can see by the look of the title, today we are going to be talking about my must-haves at the moment. These are products that I've been loving. You can call them basically like I guess my monthly favorites. I don't know if you want to because honestly I've been using these for the past couple months already and I've just been absolutely in love with these products. So if you guys want to know all about my must-haves at the moment, then just keep on watching. So for the first product, I'm so excited to announce that it is in partnership with Garnier. And I've talked about this product so many times on my vlog channel because every single time I shower and I get out and I blow dry my hair, I'm always telling you guys like, look how easy it is now for my hair to be just nice and sleek. So the product that I've been using so much is the Garnier Fructis Sleek Shot. This is how it looks. You guys have definitely probably heard me talk about it already, um, but it cuts my sleeking time in half just like how it mentions it here it literally does because what I do with this guy is I combine it with my shampoo you pretty much just use a one-on-one -on -one ratio of your shampoo and the sleek shot and then you pretty much shampoo your hair like normal and then after that it, you can rinse it and add your conditioner and go on about everything else with your shower routine um, and then once you're out once you blow dry it you'll see that it is going to be nice and sleek super straight you can completely skip the flat iron if you wanted to in which I have so many times because lately right now with my energy you guys like I don't even want to even like do my hair or anything so I just pretty much let this baby do its job and I just leave my hair like the way it is. And like I've mentioned um, on my vlog channel, I've shown you guys so many times after I shower, um, my hair is just nice and straight and sleek. So it's so amazing. Oh my God, I'm getting water all over me because literally I just got this out of my shower right now. So I really love the technology in this baby. So not only does it cut your time in half, but it also locks in for 24 hours, smoothness, shine, and frizz. So you don't even have to worry about that, especially if you're in areas where it's really hot and humid and your hair tends to get like crazy or something because I know my hair sometimes likes to act up when I'm traveling and stuff. So I always make sure to carry this guy with me at all times. And so I just love it because it does great with all conditions of weather, you know. So if you guys have been wanting to try something that will definitely cut your time in half, then I definitely suggest check out this baby. It's available in Target, in stores, and online. And also, not to mention, it is so affordable. It's literally super, super duper affordable. And that's what I love about it. So if you guys have never tried it, definitely recommend you guys check it out. You guys are going to be obsessed. <laughs> Moving on to now pretty much what is uh, skincare. I only have one product for my face and because everything else has been pretty much the same with my skincare but one that i did switch out was my eye cream and it is now this one by ula henriksen this is the banana bright eye cream i have been having a pretty much hard time sleeping at night sometimes so when i wake up i look like a dead zombie you guys not even a joke um but as you guys can see i'm pretty much halfway through with this guy and I really have been seeing a difference with this eye cream. I feel like at the beginning in the first week and a half, I want to say, I really didn't notice anything. And I remember like thinking like, oh my God, what, what, what's the point of using this eye cream? But after I pushed through that week and a half of like using it, I started noticing results of like my eyes appearing a little bit more brighter. So this carries vitamin C and collagen boosted um ingredients i guess and so it's supposed to help you know to brighten up your eyes and i really have been loving it so i love also how it feels it's not like too thick or anything it's kind of lightweight so it's not like super super heavy under your eye and it does well with makeup because obviously i i use my eyeshadows and stuff and i feel like it works fine after with makeup and all that so if you guys have been wanting an eye cream that can actually work to actually brighten up your eyes i definitely suggest this one then Moving on to the body, you guys, I have two lotions here. These are both actually from Soap and Glory. Um, these are the ones that I've been using. Um, usually before this, I was using the St. Ives, but I just got this um, not too long ago in the mail, and I started using them, and I've been obsessed. So the first one I have here is called the Luxurious Body Lotion. This one is really thick and heavy, and um, as you guys can see, I've been using just a little bit of this because a little goes a long way. It's super rich. I like to use this one more at, at nighttime, so if I'm like going to sleep or something and I need to moisturize my body again, I'll use this guy because it really does deeply hydrate your skin. But if I want something more lightweight but still doing the job of like really hydrating your body, then I go with this one, which is called Drop-In 
the lotion, which has coconut in it. And I mean, it has like coconut on there. And this smells so bomb. It really does smell like coconut, which is a scent that I really love. And yeah, it's really pretty much a lightweight moisturizer. So this one I like during the daytime. So in the mornings when I shower or something like that, I like to use this. And it also comes with vitamin A, it says here on the side. So I really love these two. So like I said, if you want something a little bit more thicker, maybe this one. But if you want something more lightweight, but still doing the job of moisturizing and everything, then I would suggest this one. But these are the two that I've been using for my body at the moment. Um, and I really love them. Now for my belly, it is something a little bit different because obviously now that I'm pregnant, I want to make sure that I'm really giving it the moisture that it needs. So that way when my belly starts to finally grow and stretch out, it's not going to be doing so much damage when it comes to stretch marks. And I know stretch marks are not something that you can just pretty much prevent because if it runs in your jeans, it's bound to happen. And I know I carry jeans that I can definitely get stretch marks because I already have stretch marks um, in other parts of my body. So I know that I'm prone to getting them and I'm pretty much just preparing my skin just so it won't get that bad. So the belly oil that I've been using is this one from Zoe Organics. This is the body oil that I use at the moment. I already finished one bottle and I pretty much went through this quickly. It is kind of expensive, I'm not gonna lie. It's like I think $20 a bottle and it's really tiny. So it is kind of more on the expensive side, but I really love it. Um, like I said, it's organic and I love the ingredients that it has in it. It has a bunch of oils in it that are really great for the skin to really deeply like hydrate it and help with it. So not only do I use this on my belly, but I also use it on my breast and also my hips and my butt. Um, so this is the body oil that I've been using. But if you guys know of any other one that is amazing and it doesn't have like a pretty like weird scent or anything, definitely let me know in the comment section. But this one smells so good. Like... I really actually enjoy this scent. The thing that made me really go into buying this one is because the reviews were all amazing. Even some people that were saying that they carry genes of like actually being prone to like the stretch marks and everything. They said that with using this, they didn't get a single stretch mark. I don't know how it's gonna be for me, you know, once the belly grows, but um, I just know that maybe this one is gonna be perfect so it can help with the skin. And also just in general, if you guys are not even pregnant and you guys are just like, you know, wanting to grow a booty or something like that because I know I got stretch marks there when I was trying to grow my booty. It's a great also oil just to use for your body just in general um, or even like in your inner thighs or something like that. So if you guys are interested, this is the um, belly oil that I'm using and I really, really love it. So as you guys know, um, my skin has been acting up a little bit and I try not to use this guy so much because I know it's pretty strong and right now for my pregnancy, I try not to use super strong um, ingredients on my skin in general, but if it's a pimple and it's really bad, then I use this guy and I just pretty much use it as a like a spot on treatment if you could say and it's the glam glow super mud uh cleansing clearing treatment i mean and this is the big bottle that i have um usually my husband uses it with me this is the mega size and what i like is that right away it dries up the pimple makes it like not so noticeable i know i have still a little scarring right there and this one over here but at least it's flat and it's not like bumpy and texturized it's just there you know so i mean if i wanted to really like disguise the whole like scarring issue i could just color correct or something but it really does a nice job of like pretty much bringing down the pimple and kind of drying it up and just in a couple days having it disappear if you could say so that's why i've been enjoying it because i know that i was using it all over my face when it was acting up but then um i read that like it's a little too strong right now for me being pregnant so i was like okay i'm just gonna use it for like a spot treatment and that's it so that's how pretty much i've been using it and it's been working like i said for me right now so i love it <laughs> so moving on to makeup i only have two products that I have to talk to you guys about that I just love okay so I know you guys are always telling me that my skin looks beautiful it has a beautiful glow and everything like that honestly when I don't have makeup on I feel like I look like a zombie and it's ugly like my skin's ugly okay so I feel like what has been helping me is my foundation it just really really helps and what I've been trying to do is just use a foundation that is gonna pretty much 
help with my glow in general. I know I use highlighters obviously to just make it more glowy looking, but honestly in general, like my rest of my face, I feel like it looks beautiful just because of the foundation that I'm using. And the one that I've been using right now is the Bobbi Brown Skin Long Wear Weightless Foundation. It does have an SPF 15, so which I love, so it can protect me from the sun. Um, this is literally full coverage. But it feels so lightweight and then also it's oil free so it has a shine control so it's not like so like you know super dewy or anything but it does give you a beautiful glow when i first started using this foundation i was not used to like the actual consistency of it because i felt like i needed more but you don't you only need a little bit and it's gonna really like do a nice job of giving you an even color and then your skin is gonna look like your skin and it's gonna look so beautiful so i've been so obsessed with it and right now um the color that i use is warm beige which is 3.5 but this is the foundation that i feel is helping my skin look so beautiful and healthy and glowy but like i said i started using this one again um because i used to use it back in the day but now I'm bringing it back into my daily routine, especially because it has the SPF, which I feel like I really need to also like take extra care of my skin right now. Um, so I've been using that foundation and it, I, I just love the way my skin looks. <laughs> now, another thing that I've been uh, using so much on the daily and I actually switched it out for my other pomade was my brow pomade. So now I'm using this one from Sigma. I use the color dark just because I have dark hair now and I like my brows pretty much dark. And this pomade, oh my God, ever since I first started using it, so many people on my Instagram were already asking me like, Oh my god, what are you using on your brows? Like, I feel like you guys have truly noticed the difference once I switched out my products for my brows. And you guys have been asking for a brow routine. So it's going to be coming soon, you guys. Honestly, right now, I don't... I didn't honestly make them super nice and clean because I'm... I have to go get them done <laughs> but uh yeah this is the, what i use today on my brows and i love it and i also use it with their um priming control brow wax this is what i use right before um as you guys can see i use it but i pretty much apply it all over my hairs i brush it out and then i add the pomade and then my brows are in place throughout the whole entire day um so yeah these two products are my die tube right now so if you guys have been wanting to try new bra products these are the ones that i recommend okay i have two last things one of them is my prenatal vitamins so i've been using these from l and i as you guys know um i love this brand and i'm just so happy with their balance pills and everything but obviously ever since i got pregnant i stopped taking their balance pills and now i'm taking their prenatal ones and i honestly love these i take them at night just because um I do also take an omega-3 um, pill along with some sometimes a calcium pill. So again, I get a little bit nauseous um, taking all of that all at once in the morning. And so I feel like throughout the day, I feel kind of nauseous. So what I do is I take them at night and it works perfect because I just go to sleep and I don't feel nauseous or anything like that. And when I wake up, I'm perfectly fine. So I've been taking these um, prenatal vitamins and I definitely love them and recommend them. Um, but yeah, so... I have had questions about like the balance pills of how I take them or just in general like how I take my pills. I just follow the directions that it has in the back. I never make up my own rules or anything. Just literally like this one it says a dietary supplement take two soft gels daily with a meal. So if you guys follow me on my vlog channel then you guys would know that sometimes I usually have a little cereal or something um, like of a small meal and then I take my prenatals. Um, so that's how I pretty much take all of my pills in general. Like I just follow the instructions in the back of how they're supposed to be taken. So whatever it says on the balance pills of how to take them, follow the instructions. And then same with the prenatals and every other pill. Now the last thing that I have are some leggings. I've been living in these leggings like literally every single week. <laughs> so these is this is how it looks. I know they look a little weird when I first have them up like this, but oh my god these are so comfortable and i just love the band of this so these are really really nice and thick they're not going to be see-through whatsoever so if you guys have been looking for good leggings just in general if you're not even pregnant like these are amazing um and they also have this really stretchable waistband so it really stretches a lot so if you're pregnant like these are nice 
because they really stretch out a lot. Um, these are from the brand Gia Monet. I hope I'm saying that right. Um, but she sent me pretty much basically like four pairs of these. And I have been just, like I said, living in these because they're just so comfortable. And right now, since I've been like bloated and stuff like that, I don't feel comfortable wearing jeans anymore just because like they fit really tight and I don't want to be having my belly be super tight or anything. I just feel like I shouldn't be doing that. So I'm avoiding the jeans completely and I've just been living in leggings. So these are the leggings I wanted to shout out because I really, really recommend them. I had already heard about the all about these leggings through my friend Yvette. And she also loves them so definitely if you're pregnant or not even pregnant in general these are amazing leggings they're so good <laughs> one more thing i completely almost forgot about these but so you guys know that with my makeup look like i still like to do my makeup just because i want to feel great i feel like when i do my makeup like i just feel great so right now that um my energy has been kind of like all over the place um which is why i'm not being so consistent uploading but you guys will understand <laughs> you guys will understand me if you guys have been pregnant then you guys know um but i have been trying to do my makeup look more on the simple side but it doesn't look simple so the way that i like to like make it seem like oh my god i went all out or something or like i have a full-on glam look is the lashes i like to wear really really dramatic lashes just because it makes the look look like super glamorous like it took so much time with it even though it's just like a normal daily routine you know but the lashes make it seem like it's something else so this is what i'm wearing right now these are from baddie b and these are the style extra they're like the most dramatic ones that they have so i really have been like aiming towards these and then also a brand that i just love so much is the lash bar i have on my lashes like crazy in here but the style that i really really recommend from the lash bar is called boss babe so it has it in the back right here boss babe oh my god they look so gorgeous so beautiful and they don't feel super heavy whatsoever even though they look really like dramatic and stuff but they don't feel heavy at all and they're just so pretty and they last you so many uses so definitely recommend those two of the lashes you guys know that i will forever love my nubinson bellas and dragon leaves because those are also super dramatic and nice um but i've just like i said been exploring a little bit in the other um brand styles that they have and so these are the other two that i wanted to mention that maybe just in case you guys are interested but yeah so that is it for pretty much my must-haves at the moment you guys if you guys have any that you guys want to share with me that i feel like i'm missing out on or something let me know um but yeah so with that my loves that is it for this video i hope that you guys enjoyed it and if you guys did don't forget to give me your eyes thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and that way you guys can be part of the birdie family but with that my loves thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys and i'll see you guys on the next video bye